Sticking with energy, check out crude oil getting crushed today, hitting its lowest level since August as COVID fears put a damper on demand yet again. WTI is up, uh, is, excuse me, down more than 15% in just the last week to finish its worst month uh, since March of 2020. Tim, what do you make of the action today? It's, it's interesting how we go from releasing um, oil from the SPR to now worried about demand. Yeah, and, and I, I wasn't a big fan of that release. And, and I think uh, on some level, it, it really showed structurally where we actually may still have supply uh, issues. I'm, I'm not worried about demand. And, and I guess, you know, I, I, you have a dynamic here with, uh, with COVID that I, I realize we've had some headwinds, but ultimately demand is not the issue on the energy side. Uh, we've talked about Biden's policy on energy and why that's ultimately great for fossil fuels. It may not be great for the future. Um, but it certainly worked in energy's favor. You're down almost 20% on Brent. Um, this is, you know, November hasn't traded through the 200 day as it did today. I don't think you need to buy it, but energy is way oversold here, and I would be looking for my spot. 